Our next guest not only made his dream into reality, but is helping people along the way. At just 20 years old, Tabidi Stevens is the CEO of Steps by Stevens. It's a casual shoe line that's mission includes giving back to those who need it the most. I am so happy that you're here with us. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. You're actually here because you're a Morehouse student, and of course, it's a big football classic this weekend. Howard versus Morehouse. Who's going to win that game? Um, the Maroon Tigers. Okay, that is going to win. <laughs> you know, when when I first heard about your story, it was in a Black Enterprise article, and I was just so impressed with you as a young man who's taken on, you know, some of these big issues that we're talking about, poverty and, and homelessness and, and uh, kids who don't have enough to eat. Tell us about your mission and your vision. Why why did you get started with Steps by Stevens? Um, well, uh, in high school, originally, um, I went to a high school, Grady High School in Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah. Um, it's a very, very well-known high very school. Very famous. Um, I guess you could say the disparity between my two classes of friends, for instance, uh, one of my best friends drove to school in a Bentley every day, mm -hmm. while the other one was taking his lunches home from school. Yeah. So I always saw firsthand, I guess you could say, uh, how people were living, right. like how people really live. Mm -hmm. And I always wanted to do something about it, but at the time I never really could, you know, I was, I was a child. Yes. So the Monday after I graduated, I took it upon myself to go ahead and try to start a company where I could give back to the community as well as, you Because you gotta have money to give money, right? Correct, correct, right, <laughs> right. right, right. Um, this happens to be the product, and I don't want to ignore this uh, fine shoe line that you have come up with. This is your vehicle. Did it come from a love of shoes yourself? Yes, yes, yes. I, uh, I've been a sneaker collector since I was about 13. I've always had a love for sneakers and okay, fashion. Okay, okay. So you, so it made perfect sense. Yes, yes, yes. You did it. And now, one that right now you have the, the the main. It's like a cloth line and a leather line, and on it it says Steps by Stevens. And when you buy a pair of tennis shoes, where does that money go? Um, well, last year it was 15 percent of the proceeds would go to either a church, a children's shelter, or a homeless shelter mm -hmm. in the city of Atlanta. But this year we're actually upping it to 20 percent. So That's now, fantastic. Yeah, so now we use 20%, and uh, what we do is we go out, we'll go out to the local uh, Publix, Kroger, what we do, we'll talk to the managers and see if we can get a discount right. or something on the food prices, and what we'll do is go out and take our uh, earnings from each quarter and go out and buy non-perishable goods, things such as rice, pasta, uh, tuna, canned goods, right. and things like that, and we will drop them off at the shelters. It would be very easy for you to keep all of the money that you make. You realize that? Yes. You don't want to do that? Um, I believe that you always give 10% back, mm -hmm. so we try to try to take it a step further right. and give 20. In those steps, okay. And you, you also, we, we talk a lot about, in this area too, how maybe the only meal a kid's going to get is what they get at school. school. And so you're addressing um, that too. Tell us about that effort within some of the communities, the schools in our communities. Um, oh, well, we work, uh, we haven't really worked with communities or, I mean, schools exactly, but we work uh, closely like hand to hand with shelters. Mm -hmm. um, Malcolm, my partner and myself. And he's here. Yeah. Hi to Malcolm this morning. Yeah, he is. It, ta it always takes a good team of people to do things. So Malcolm's yes, here with you this morning. Okay, yes, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, we'll just go out and usually Malcolm, he's in charge of all the philanthropy, all right. of the giving back. And what he do, he is the correspondent between the shelters and myself. Okay. So he'll let me know, you know, what the shelters need. So, you know, the people from the head of the shelters will call Malcolm, mm -hmm. you know, tell him, you know, we might need some pasta, rice, or don't come in on Christmas, come in a few weeks later because right. everybody else forget. is coming in. Exactly. Right, right. So what happens, um, what happens next? Where, where do you see the company going? Because you're a senior. Yes, yes. And you're going to have, I mean, you know, most, most college students, they're, they're coursework, a party here or there, you know, dealing with their social life. You're doing all that plus doing this, uh, but you will soon graduate for Morehouse. Yes. This is your last year. What happens next? Um, well, we'll be releasing three new colors in okay. a few months. Um, right now, you're brown and black, brown, blue? Brown and blue okay. are our only standard colors, but we'll be releasing a red as well as a black to go along with the two colors. Mm -hmm. um, in May, I'm set to graduate. Okay. Um, I'm looking to go to grad school, continue Steps by Stevens, and possibly uh, go somewhere in corporate America and try to handle all three. Fantastic. Okay, well, let me tell you something. Not as my role here, but as uh, as a mom, as uh, someone who is invested in the community that I live in, I appreciate what you're doing for the community you're living in, and hopefully it'll spread worldwide. Thank you. Thank and you'll you. be everywhere. This is Tabidi Stevens. He is the CEO of Steps by Stevens. If people want to help out, where do they go?
Um, you can find us online. You can Google Steps by Stevens, or you can go directly to our website, www.stepsbystevens.com. Okay. We'd like to see young men doing positive things, so thank you for being here with us Thank you for having today. us. Today. Tony, over to you. Mm -hmm. That's fantastic. What and still in school. And still in school. A CEO. And still in school. And still in school. That's great. Yeah. Very good. All right. <laughs>